Howdy, Crystal Conclave. It's Neshi. We're here in Duel Links. Gonna get this Crystal Beast grind going. Let's go. This hand is really rough. Against Cyber Dragons, this deck is really rough. I would love... Can we switch? Can you go first and I'll go second? That would be sweet. We might take out a Promise, honestly. But, like, what other card would we play? I want to cut a Promise down. But there's no other defensive cards that we have. I have a dream ticket. I could get another Forbidden Lance. So that's an option. This is the kind of hand that's just, if he opens the nuts, that's unfortunate. That's what I'm deciding. Executive decision. It's unfortunate if he just opens the nuts. Crystal power, just a flex. See, I, I was complaining about the Crystal Promise, but realistically, if this was the one of Promise, then I'd still be complaining. Right? Pale paleo cards are scary. Sounds like the best green screen. It's the meme screen. It is. Oh, it's the meme screen. <laughs> the new card says discard this tribute to Nec... Oh, yeah. that That's what I was thinking. The new Necroz support might come out, and it'll have just more graveyard reliance stuff, kind of like Mirror. Mirror is the one that banishes the materials from the graveyard, right? What's my personal best deck with normal Yu-Gi-Oh? You're looking at it. You must be new here, Jelmer Van Zelderen. We're happy to have you, but I play Crystal Beast. Cyber Dragon Core, all right, that's that's fine. He didn't open Cosmic Cyclone, so not completely the nuts, but still pretty nuts. It's crazy. Also has a Negate Tribute Monster, Negate Banish. His was... Yeah, that was that was really good. Oh, my best was probably Striker Draco. Oh, if you're talking about best, best, I guess. But, like, technically, technically Crystal, Be Crystal Beast has gotten me more tops than Striker Draco, if we're being honest. Uh, we don't want to hit any of those with our Forbidden Lance because he's just going to tribute the other two. As long as he can get a Rampage, then it's like, Three. Oh yeah, you could do more than one for Rampage, huh? Um, to the number of fusion materials. So that's why I did three. So you can just pop all three. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And he has the overload in hand. This is why it's just so rough. We have a Forbidden Lands, but it just doesn't matter because he's just gonna overload it away. <sighs> Alright, let's it go through. He's just gonna do it anyway, because he has those three. Did he set the overload? Why would he do that? What's the last card in his hand? Uh, we just... I'm very confused right now. I always get confused by Cyber Dragon players because it seems like they should always kill me, but then they make one weird play, and then I'm in a winning position off of it. Like, what is happening? <laughs> He's summoning two Rampage. What's up, Nassim El Asal? How's it going? You're hoping you get the trap. <laughs> oh, that's fine with me. He gets his cyber style. If I bounce one of these back, he's just going to normal summon it and then activate Fusion Gate. So we have to wait for the Rampage. What happened to that Overload? What's going on here? Tony took all the skill from the Cyber Dragon player skill pool. They're running on fumes. Yeah, Tony and Yasin, <laughs> they're running on fumes. Tony and Yasin just took all the skill from Cyber Dragons. Double 
Uh, that's fine with me. Go ahead. Unless he has that one card. If he has that one card in his hand, the harmonic wave thing that boosts attack, I'm fine with that. If he has that, he's nice. But I want to activate Crystal Conclave. Let's get that Tiger out of our deck so we don't draw into it. What is with... He didn't have a response to the Conclave. I guess it was Damage Step. What's happening? Because if he activates Overload... He can't, right? Because it has to be the only card that attacks. Where's the? Where did that Overload Fusion go? Okay, there it is. Or Cyberload Fusion, yeah. Hmm. How many attacks does this thing have? He only has four e EX. Just sends all of his cards. Oh, does it does pier do piercing? Does not. Okay. Ooh, we win. Right? So we'll just get out of Utopia. And sit on it. So we're able to just wait with Utopia. I'm going to keep him in attack position so that Chimera Tech Rampage Dragon can't attack over it. And now he's just top decking. So we're actually in a good position. I don't know why he didn't just win, right? We have to flex, right? Crystal power. Wait, this isn't Bakugan? Yeah. It's not Bakugan. Well, look at Sapphire Pegasus's little ball thing there. That's a Bakugan, right? It's an Aquos. Bakugan is Yu-Gi-Oh 2 with dice change with dice change my mind. <laughs> I guess. You think he only has one rampage? If he does, he's bad, right? I think that's what we can agree on. Summon Castell, you're right. If we had Castell, we'd win. Oh, does he just attack again? How many attacks does this guy have? Excuse me? <laughs> what happened? Is that how it works? It can make attacks up to how many monsters I have? I didn't think it'd count that. Okay, we... Yes, we're good. I didn't think it worked like that. But now I know. If he has Cosmic Cyclone, that sucks. Sapphire Pegasus kind of looks like Mega Pega. It is Mega Pega. His two monsters in his extra deck. <laughs> Three attacks on monsters, one per material used. Yeah, but I don't know. I didn't think it checked that it was a monster. I don't know. All right, we're still sitting pretty right here. Unless that's like a Forbidden Lance, then that sucks. Okay, we're good. <sighs> Reading is hard, you're right. Reading on stream is a little difficult. I thought I knew what Cyber Dragon cards did. Ooh, we win. Look at that. I love drawing Red Resonator and just winning. We won! Resonator, get resonating. I don't know how we pulled that out. That, unless that's a Kiteroid in hand. Then we win. How did we get out of that? 
how does Utopia not negate what Chimera Tech uh, Rampage Dragon does? Or what is it? Cyber End Dragon. I forget what it is. It doesn't matter because it's back in the extra deck. We'll never see it again. And then we just attack for game. Oh, we have to... We have to crystal power, though. Oh. <laughs> How did we do that? We're <laughs> we shouldn't have won that. Why does he only play one rampage? What? That just doesn't make sense. If he had, if he just played another rampage in his extra deck, he would have won. Like, what is that? <laughs> I don't get it. Why do Cyber Dragon players sometimes make weird plays like that? Like not playing two Rampage. Oh, Shiranui. Summon that guy, set three pass. Seems like typical Shiranui, eh? I'm going to go ahead and I'll activate a Necro Valley and see what he does. I don't have anything good to parallel Twister right now. We have Necro Valley against Sheer so that's really good. <laughs> Alright, Sapphire Pegasus. Meet my favorite steed. Crystal B Sapphire Pegasus. It really is my favorite steed. We're not gonna bother going for game right here. Because he probably has some crazy back row. Sheer Nui back row is always the best. It's always the best kind of back row. Ooh, is he going to DC because we're playing Necro Valley? Because if he activates Drowning, then that's just kind of amazing. Plus he's top decking, right? Because... He has to out the Necro Valley in order to play the game. Plus, if we target his monster, we play into Bad Aim, and Bad Aim's able to destroy. Okay, so he does have Cosmic. What's he going to get rid of? Okay, yeah, he kind of has to. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Summon the chain. Do you have another cosmic cyclone that you can't activate because you have a thousand life points? You hate Shiranui? Yeah. Love crystals so much, but your aroma you farmed from the card trainer with coins? That's fair. You know, there's something to be said about a deck that you make yourself out of your own stuff, so. That's fair enough. DB just went down for you, and Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro hasn't updated since April, so you guess you're done crafting. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, the chillin'. DB's been down for a couple days. Or not down down, but like, it hasn't been working very well for a couple days, huh? Yep, that's all fine with me. You, yeah, sure knew he sucks. Try out Grand Maju. I don't have any of the Grand Maju cards. Isn't that a really expensive deck? I do have three Grand Maju, I'm pretty sure. But I don't have any of the Golden Castle stuff. Yeah, he's, he did. He was screwed if Necro Valley didn't get popped. But you can never activate Necro Valley safely against Shiranui. They're always prepared for it, which is good. You know, that's how it should be. I shouldn't be able to just activate Necro Valley and immediately win the game. That would be lame. That would be funny for me, but... Yep. Activate your effect. Uh, does this guy make him lose permanent attack? Uh, it does make him lose permanent attack. <sighs> Think full Crystal Beast is good in PvP? It is good in PvP. This is what I'm doing right now. Uh, 
Does he have the Forbidden Lands? <laughs> he doesn't. Do we just win? Alright, I'm going to Normal Summon the Sapphire Pegasus. Check out his delays. So there is a delay. Just by a little bit. I'm going to activate Crystal Power. Or it could just be the lag. And then we're going to pop a card. And if it's a chainable card... I like that hit. Yo, let's go! <laughs> let's go. Yeah, we're always slapping Shiranui. Shiranui's got nothing on us. Shiranui gets destroyed every time. Crystal Beast is just the best deck. We're doing this. Let's go! Mirror match! Unless we're playing against Crystron. But I'd much rather like the mirror match. Mirror match, let's go! Give it your all, because I sure am. He's not playing a mat in sleeves. Oh, he's playing over 20 cards. This is probably just Crystron. Set pass. Or he's just playing Rainbow Dragon. I just never see Jesse on the ladder. <laughs> I love this. I haven't seen... I haven't played against a Jesse Anderson that's not Chris Tron in like two years. Crystal Power. I'm not going to Parallel Twister that away. I'm just going to make my Conclave active. Because we can't kill this turn anyway. <gasps> Yo! It's Crystal Beast! <laughs> but it's like actual Rainbow Dragon Crystal Beast. Let's go! Crystal Beast Mirror Match. Let's go. What's up, Crystal Quatpi? How's it going? Sorry I missed your message. <laughs> I'm glad that she liked that uh, play with Crystal Conclave. How do I always start with Sphere? Because we just put it in. It wants to know how I test it out. <laughs> I do read every comment. Thank you, the chillin'. Also, check out the tw the chillin' on twitch.tv. He also reads every comment. Uh, if you want to see some League, if you're a fan of League, then that's the guy for you. Uh, we're going to get this promise. We're going to try and win this turn. Let's go. This is how we're going to play it out. We're going to bounce back that Crystal Beast Emerald Tortoise. Normal summon our Sapphire Pegasus. See, this is the difference between a Crystal Master and an average Crystal Beast player. Average Crystal Beast players... I still love this guy for playing Crystal Beast. Don't get me wrong. This guy's like... It's like other players are down here. This guy's up here. All right. This is like the king of games. I'm not even here. I'm on like... I'm on like in the middle between this guy and the king of games. So like... This guy's very high in my book just for playing Crystal Beast. Probably my favorite match of the day. <laughs> this is so sweet. But sadly, we just have the better deck. He just sets pass... And we're able to actively... Oh, we don't want to do that. <laughs> we're able to just proactively clear his field. He had the other tortoise. We gotta say some kind of voice line. Actually, they're my family. Sapphire Pegasus, whirl up a storm.
Sapphire Tornado. Crystal Beast. I'm sorry I had to do it to you, Jesse. I'm sorry. Man, it, it makes me feel so bad that I have to beat another Crystal Beast player. A fellow Crystal Beast player. It hurts my heart. But I had to I had to show him who the Crystal Master was. Thank you guys for coming out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Topaz Tiger, he a known fighter. Like the Cobalt Eagle, I'ma fly higher.